Okay, this is just a uh, quick follow-up video to my, um, you know, my previous cover for the uh, Power A Fusion Pro Two. Um, I'm just gonna talk about a few things. Yeah, um, I purchased the Power A Spectra Illuminated back in like I, w I believe. Um, 2015, this was back when like, uh, yeah, MK, MKX was hype. MKX was really, uh, you know, popping off. Um, yeah, I just want to point out a few things that, uh, it just, uh, came to my attention when I was, uh, you know, looking at my old, my old controllers and stuff. Um, yeah. Um, when I Googled, Google researched this controller here, it said that it uh, features dual rumbles and impulse triggers. Now, I don't know for sure if that's true or not, but... <laughs> That's pretty crazy. Uh, yeah, because impulse triggers, uh, I don't know when those those were actually released, if they were officially released f uh, first on the um, Xbox uh, One controller or officially introduced on this controller. I don't know for sure. I don't know the, um, this, uh, the background for that, but... Um, that's pretty crazy though you know looking back at the uh specifications for this controller uh it apparently features impulse triggers which is uh you know pretty crazy um i'm guessing this was this pad was like probably um possibly you know possibly engineered for uh racing games maybe back then I don't know for sure, but um, impulse triggers weren't even like a thing back then. You know, weren't weren't even thought of really. But um, yeah, I got my my Spectra my enhanced wired Spectra Loom Loom. Uh, gosh, I can't even speak correctly. I'm like stumbling over my words. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I got the, uh, Spectra Enhanced Wired controller here, which is, uh, really, like I said again in my previous video, this is really not wired. This is, you know, this is plug and play. Um, I purchased this controller, like, probably a year ago, I believe. So, uh, yeah, this one's, this one's also, you know... Good quality, good quality pad. Uh, you know, if you're an RGB fanatic, you know this is a good one to pick up. Um, uh, they probably, I think they might have another version of this. Uh, another version of this enhanced um rgb spectra controller like a like with um you know with the capture button and all that kind of stuff maybe i have to look it up I pro i'm probably wrong i don't know but um yeah uh what i wanted to go over is that uh i wanted to point out if you happen to come across this controller if you find it anywhere online please 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 pick it up um this controller is like, you know, you can hear it. You can literally hear. You can hear the clicks, the, um, you know, the clicks of this pad. And this is very rare, you know, for a third party controller to have that same click, you know, digital, uh, digital D pad as the, um, the standard Microsoft Xbox One controllers, you know, this is this is very rare. Uh, 
Microsoft doesn't usually, uh, you know, give out their proprietary uh, technology to um, third party wired controllers. So you can you can like actually feel the button presses in this pad when you click. You can actually, you know, feel the uh, the digital uh, responses. So this is very rare. Uh, I played a lot, a lot of MKX, a lot of MKX with this controller. Um, <laughs> this controller is, is absolutely, you know what I'm saying? You, this is, this is the way to go. Like, honestly, uh, digital, digital, uh, inputs like this, Chris inputs, mecha tactile inputs. That's the way to go for, uh, games like Mortal Kombat, you know what I mean? Um, excuse me. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Yeah, Mortal Kombat, you know, it's it's one of those games you cannot slouch, you know, you can't slouch with inputs, you know, in terms of like those excessive combos that you're trying to execute, you need precise inputs. And so this was like, you know, this was a godsend for me, like back when that, uh, that game was released. <laughs> I, uh, you know, I labbed a lot of Jason, you know, back then, and this controller really, you know, helped me, uh, you know, do a lot of, a lot of crazy stuff. Um, yeah, <laughs> RGB fans, man, this is a good one. This, I love the, uh, love the design of this controller, the, um, you know, the, the size, the width, the, um. Just all the all the various features, you know, everything, everything that came with this controller is just, you know, it's it's probably very rare, very hard to find. But if you find it, uh, definitely uh, pick it up. It's a uh, it's one of those rare rare gems that a lot of people slept on, you know, a lot of. Uh, Controller enthusiasts, you know, things of that nature. Um, including myself, uh, I'm definitely a, uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm definitely a pad player uh, in terms of fighting games. I don't, I don't, uh, I have a few arcade sticks, like two arcade sticks, like Universal uh, for PlayStation and Xbox. Um Never, never, uh, never really was comfortable with, uh, arcade sticks like that, but, um, I can definitely use them, but I've always been like a, um, like a pad player and I, uh, <laughs> I purposefully set this up, you know, set this color up because these, these are like my favorite color combinations. Um, <laughs> kind of reminds me of my childhood, you know, back when, uh, You know, I kind of like the the Snake Eyes, um, Snake Eyes, um, Jojo, uh, <clears throat> figure had these kind of you know these similar colors like back in the day, like old school stuff. He had those same uh, same colors on his gear and stuff. This this kind of uh, pinkish, pinkish uh, color on his visor and the blue, you know, blue on his uh. This bluish, bluish color on his, um, like probably I would say bluish, bluish purple. If it's like it's coming up in the camera, it's purple. It's it's coming up in the camera as blue, but it's actually you know like a purplish color. But yeah, that was like Snake Eyes, you know, old school colorway, you know, back in the um, GI Joe animated series, um. But yeah, uh, definitely, man. If you come across this pad, man, just you know, it's it's definitely it is perfect, perfect for games like Mortal Kombat. Very, very good, very precise, precise inputs. Much like the um, the uh, official Xbox controllers. Uh, yeah, thank you, um, thank you for watching.